Now, NBC5 First Warning Weather, the area's certified most accurate forecast. Kind of a gloomy day today, at least earlier today. Yeah, we'll have a little more sun in the mix tomorrow, and okay. then um, the weekend looks okay. We're still balancing a lot of clouds, but I think mm -hmm. the, the rainstorm misses and any shower that we get uh, would be very minimal and probably not changing any plans. So. That's good. Yeah, let's take a look. This is right now in Burlington, Church Street, and the temperature is still 49. Most of us are in the 40s and low 50s, but there is a cooler pocket. Not that it's surprising that it's in Sar uh, Saranac Lake, but it's a little surprising that it's right now, especially considering so many of us have clouds and we still have some showers on the map. We've got one little band of rain there sneaking into St. Lawrence County. Everywhere else is barely being picked up by the radar, so very light little sprinkles. We basically have this big spin that is north of us, the upper level low, slowly exiting. So that's how we're slowly brighter and slowly drier for tomorrow. Just a few showers coming through in the afternoon. A mostly dry weekend, so that's somewhat of a change and good news, though it does turn windy by Sunday. And temps are slightly below average into early next week and then some moderation by late next week. Turns out nice, but that's way out in the future. So here's uh, future cast. Sunshine for a lot of us in the morning, especially south, clouds north, and then that band of clouds and showers basically crosses the whole region tomorrow. So it's going through the Champlain Valley, 3, 4 o'clock, uh, down to about Scroon Lake and up to Newport at that time. And then going south of there through the day should be some pretty nice clearing behind it, at least temporary clearing for later tomorrow. And then on Friday, there's a lot of clouds in play. Some areas get lucky, probably a situation on Friday where the valleys are brighter. So you go down to Hanover south, pretty bright on Friday. Champlain Valley, especially along the north way on Friday. Sometimes when the wind comes down off the mountains, it opens up a big gap in the clouds. Those would be the favored areas for sunshine on Friday, but it's not wholesale clearing. Here's the weekend. See the clouds, a lot of them around on Saturday. The rain, though, way down to the south, down towards the Finger Lakes into Connecticut. So it stays away. We break out into some sunshine by later on Saturday. You see the big picture here, most of this rain going south of us. The only thing, there's another storm up to the north. Not that it's really coming this way, but there's a little spoke of moisture that tries to get in. So that is why we're forecasting just a sprinkle chance on Saturday and Sunday. It's not because of the storm going south. It's whatever would sneak in from the north and it'd be very light. The wind does start to pick up, though, on Sunday, 20 to 30 miles per hour as that storm strengthens. And we're still talking about gusts on Monday. So Sunday, Monday, that is the breezy to maybe windy time frame. But we will squeeze out some sun over the weekend. Most would be Saturday later in the day, but we will refine that uh, tomorrow especially. Look at next week, though. Uh, we rise up into the low 60s, lots of sun, and many dry days, many totally dry days in a row. Brian Ellis.